Good morning, guys. Actually, it is almost 5 a.m. I can't believe it. I woke up at 3.30 this morning. Really crazy. I just was watching it. It was kind of... Ooh, those lights look really awesome. <laughs> oh, that looks really cool. Alright, so... Just had a really nice sleep for the rest of the night. <laughs> because, I mean, uh, last time I went to sleep at like 10.15. I woke up at 3.30, then went back to bed at 5, and woke up again. Okay, guys. So, I don't know where I still suffer that, but, yeah. So, anyways. Today, actually, is another day with a broken arm. And this time I don't know if we're even able to go out. Whoa. See that? You see? At least it's gone a little bit better, though. I mean, at least that's the point. Okay, uh, wait, where am I? Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, so. Well, I kind of wet the bed a little bit. So, well, actually, my arm, I can kind of control it now because it doesn't hurt a lot anymore. So, yeah. That's the big deal. So, I thought I was telling you something a little bit brave enough. But, because of that, if this didn't even happen, then we would already go to the ski area by now. So, if we're going to Green Park Hotel, then we had to cancel it this year. If I wouldn't have broke my arm, we would already be possibly even going there by now. But since I broke my arm, I couldn't really go anywhere to ski this year. Last year we went to two places. Last year we went to two places in February. One was the Green Park, and one was under our hotel or something. So last year in February we went to two hotels. This year we went to zero hotels. Next year we'll find another one. So we have to wait another winter. So uh, I decided to shut down my computer for a bit. I wish I went on my computer. Oh, well, look at that light there over there. And that looks really funny. That light over there. And I'm kind of sorry, that's not one. The. Nothing. So here he has finally recognized that face. Mr. Bean's face? <laughs> it's not Mr. Bean's face. Cannot be Mr. Bean's face. It was not last night, but it was the other night, uh, Tuesday night, the night after that morning I broke my arm. It was that part. Uh, we were watching the Mr. Bean movie. In fact, yesterday we were watching a Mr. Bean movie. And then we kind of laughed because he's a really funny guy. Oh, sorry. He's a really funny guy. You know what are you looking at? Well... I'll bring him play some Xbox or something. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh my god, it's still working. Mm. Oh god. Uh, Alright guys, uh, I'm just gonna do something really crazy but funny. Yeah, you're about to see it right now. Just watch. Just watch. That's what you want to do you want? So we are going home early today, right? That's correct. Nice. Uh, yeah, uh, it's not even one thirty-eight. Oh, it's not a beautiful day outside. Is it? Yes, it is. Yeah. We're going home a little bit early. Wait, where is it? Where is it, where is it? Where is it called? 
Okay. 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 About some time ago, oh, about some time ago, uh, we, okay, uh, uh, yeah, oh, yeah, let's go, well, now we're driving, and, yeah, it was a little early, it's a little early, uh, because I broke my arm or something, we went to talk about it, to school tomorrow. Oh. oh, it's actually kind of warm, isn't it? 16. Uh, actually, it's uh, more accurate than 33. Yeah, more accurate than 33. Maybe under the sun might be 33 Celsius that's, that's degrees. Right. A few shows coming up soon. Sure. I would like to watch the West Side Story though. Uh, that is what I use. I mean, I still love as a as a youth and great. Yeah, it's of... continuing uh, from 1st to 18th March. Okay. And we still have a week because it's today, 23rd February. So we might even be able to watch one of these uh, really nice shows, hopefully. One day, my father will believe in the fact that two plus two is seven trillion. Well, as soon as my son starts believing that one plus two is and one plus three is not four. Yes, it is four. One plus three is four. Well, it depends on certain tricky question situations. Remember the one I guess. Yeah, it was a few months ago when he gave me that question. It was a really trick question, so uh, 3 plus 1 is really 4. I'll find more tricky questions for you. Yep, uh, yeah. Uh. Alright, I can even uh, say that um, 5 plus 5 is 25. Uh, minus one, which is ten. Is that right? Yes, I'm doing kind of mathematics jokes right now. Actually, five plus five is ten. Um, I'm saying that five plus five is twenty-five. And then you replied five. It's just like it's just like algebra. For example, let's say x is three and three uh, x is nine. Mm, that might be one. Very good approach. Yes. And very accurate also. Yes, that's a very accurate one. It's very accurate one. Very accurate. Very accurate. 
or we can't even say that. Uh, uh, we can't pick a different number. Let's pick D. Let's pick uh, D is four. So if D is four, then twenty. If, uh, if 40 times 15.5 uh, 40 times 15.5 uh, hmm. uh, is that uh, okay so 40 times 15 now that is 600 and times 16 is 640 so that's 620 is that right? yes mm. yes it is 14, I mean 40, times uh, 15 and a half is really 620. Whoa, drop the camera. Anyway, whatever. How about another algebra thing? How about another other one? If, if, if n is 111, how about is 6n? Devil. Devil number. Devil. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, so that's a really crazy algebra function. Actually, this vlog is a little bit about mathematics because what about 1069? What about if n was 1069? Hmm, not too hard to solve it. But as I said, n is 111, and if you did 6, and you got the number of the devil, which is 666, and I think that's a little bit of a funny number too for me, but for some of you, it might not be. Alright guys, that's it for this really fun mathematics vlog, but uh, I don't know if I can still write today because of my arm. It doesn't hurt so much anymore, but mom wants to keep me keep this on until um, the time they remove the cast. So guys, still get this, and yeah, bye. See you tomorrow. Oh.